Dylan, good morning. Jeff, you've got somebody over your shoulder, man. Oh, man. You know somebody that back there. That's one of my favorite you know My favorite country singers <laughs> now. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Well, greetings from Las Vegas, Dylan. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. And uh, I have to say, I, you know, I'm I'm an electronic music fan. I'm a DJ, EDM. I was watching your videos, listening to your music, and I'm telling you, it's it's fantastic. You know, I, you got a new fan right here. I appreciate that, man. Whatever we can do to bring the other genres ever in the country, we'll do it. So. Oh, absolutely. And your new album, Living My Best Life, you, most of your songs were inspired by your life, weren't they? Yeah, I've been with my wife since I was 15 years old. So a good old love song is pretty easy for me to write and record and relate to. Uh, not There's more than that on this new album, Live My Best Life, but uh, there's definitely the love songs on there. And you co-penned eight of the 16 songs on your new album. How is the collaborative effort when you're writing songs with someone else? You know, it's always different. Um, first of all, I love songwriting. And, you know, I may have an idea and I call them and say, hey, let's write this. Or we may just all schedule to get into a room and just bash out ideas until something sticks, something I relate to. And But at the same time, man, there's so many great songs out there, especially in this town of Nashville, and great songwriters that you can't overlook it. You know, at the end of the day, it's all about a great song. And uh, that was my that was my goal for this album, was to put great music on it. And in the world of country music, writers are stars as well, more than any other type of music, huh? Yeah, I mean, there's uh, on just on this album, the songwriters, you got Tyler Hubbard, you got Thomas Red, you've got Brian Kelly, you got Hardy. Hardy's a writer on this album. So there's some artists on this album who are also some very, very talented songwriters. And tell me about going on tour. Are you excited to meet your fans? Yes. I mean, look, we're out here. We're out here all year touring, but the amen to that tour uh, this fall, really looking forward to be out on that and, um, you know, headlining these these clubs and, and venues across the country. So it's always fun to get in front of the fans and especially your fans, you know, the ones that are paying hard money to come see you and sing your music. So uh, really looking forward to being out there on that. Now, I'm a Las Vegas native and my family came to Las Vegas in the 1950s. And guess where they came from, Dylan? Grand Junction, Colorado, you know, and you're you're going to be there on August 18th. And I used to spend my summers as a boy in Grand Junction, Colorado. Well, any pointers? What I, where do I need to go? What do I need to do? Oh, it's it's been a while since I've been back. You know, I was going to ask you for pointers for Nashville. That's one of the last cities in America that I have not visited. And I wanted to ask you, since you live there now, what where do I need to go first when I visit? You know what? I've been here 11 years and this town has outgrown me. Uh, I had to move out of this town because it's so busy. Uh, I still live in the suburbs. I still live outside of Nashville. But you know what, man? Just go to Broadway and you will you will find what to do. No doubt. Uh, I've been, you know, I've been watching Hee Haw since I was a kid with my grandparents. So I want to visit the Grand Old Opry. That has been that and Graceland are my bucket list right there. Those two places. Well, you should definitely do that. Absolutely. Sure. You know, and don't forget, Dylan, Las Vegas would love to have you too, man. I know. We're coming to Vegas this, this Sunday. Yes. We're going to so be. I, that is, it's, it, that's going to be just the, the show, isn't it, of the year here? It's going to be great, man. We're looking forward to getting back to Vegas. And uh, it's been a while since we've been there. So we'll be there this weekend and uh, looking forward to it. Well, congratulations on New Truck. Did it just hit number one? We hit number one this week. Rang the bell. We're at the top. Yeah, I watched it a couple times, man. You got some guns, and I'm not talking about the rack in the back window, man. You got some big arms, man. You you need to have a fitness video after that. Oh, I don't know about all that, man. I'm just trying to <laughs> I'm trying to stay young and 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 just you know in shape. So I don't think I'm a bodybuilder or anything. <laughs> Well, Dylan, all special effects on camera. Oh, yeah, sure it is. Yeah. <laughs> all that computer generated effects. Dylan, congratulations. Number one song, your new tour, your new album. You're on fire. Uh, we can't wait to see you in Las Vegas. And uh, thanks so much for joining me today. I appreciate it. Yeah, man. Thanks for taking the time. We'll see you soon. Okay.